Lorraine from Wagga Woods and I'm an environmental educator and I work all over the UK um, working teaching um, about woodlands and different habitats all over the UK. Hello, I'm Annie Mullen, I'm Community Engagement Officer with Fun Valley Landscape Partnership. I work with schools, um, youth groups and the public to involve them with heritage projects. Um, such as looking after woodlands, uh, recording wildlife, um, dry storm warm, anything that helps improve the heritage of the landscape. Hello, my name is Michael Cosgrove and I'm an education officer for the Locks Agency. My job is to go around and promote uh, understanding all the river foil and all its catchment rivers uh, and the salmon, uh, sea trout and brown trout up in Hello, well, my name is Seamus Carp and I work for Northern Ireland Environment Agency. And I'm the site manager here at the Nest Country Park and I look after the access and health and safety and the wilderness management of the park here. So today we're with a secondary school from Derry, London Derry, and uh, out in Nest Country Park. And we're with some pupils from one of the schools who are interested potentially in the types of jobs that we do. So they're going to ask some questions of the panel here to find out about how they might have a career like ours. So, any questions? Yes? Do you have to go to university to get a job like that? Well, if I start off, I did, yes, I've got a couple of degrees. I'm a trained biology teacher, and then I've got what's called a Master of Science in Ecological Management. But you don't always have to. How about you, Anne? Uh, yes, I went to the University in Wales, and I did environmental biology and environmental impact assessment. But um, I also volunteered a lot, and probably the volunteer work I did was more, even more important than the degree. So, if I experience of an education. Yeah, I did a degree in teaching in England, and I came back here. But I've always had an interest in uh, wildlife and science, and history, and things like that. There, so if you have an interest in something, you just follow it up and keep it going, and you'll you'll never know where where you end up. Yeah, and I went to university as well, and I managed to do Irish history degree. Business studies and a countryside management degree as well. So, um, and plus, I come from a farming background and I'm a, a genuine interest in the wildlife and the countryside around me, so especially my local area. So, it does help, and like as Ali said, volunteering does help as well to get experience of that type of environment you want to work in. What do you like most about your work? Um, I suppose I work all over the UK, so I meet some really interesting people um, from many different areas of the country <coughs> and the community. And I just love working outdoors and seeing all the amazing biodiversity or wildlife. Is geography and science useful in this job? Um, I think geography and science are very useful. I'm more of a science background and I wish I had done geography at uh, GCSC. So if you are doing this, I would definitely recommend geography and your biology is very important. But all your sciences are important. Um, but uh, equally, maths and English are important in every job. Mm -hmm. as well. Uh, yeah, if you have an interest in science, it makes it easier. Uh, same goes for geography as well. Um, I think connect geography and science. You connect all subjects really to each other uh, and what you're learning. Uh, I used to love geography. I still do love geography as well. So listen to your teachers and, and uh, do your work in your program. And house training, which does sort of give me an opening of sort of scientific input and input. So I um, do like geography. I have a high level in geography, so a low level. So and also job for just for just general use as well for understanding things and getting their whereabouts and locations and localities and rock formations and weather and stuff. So it is important. So, but as Michael said here as well, I could agree with him. School days your best days of life and enjoy them, and you'll learn a lot from these guys here doing all their stuff.